right, how's it going everyone? Today I'm up at uh, the lower Kings River. That's Pine Flat up there, right above that dam. Flows down this way underneath this bridge and out that way. Trying to go for some uh, rainbow trout. Hopefully catch some. Uh, if we don't do good here, thinking about running down towards Avocado Lake. I hear they've been stocking that lake too. Uh, there's also bass there, so the trout's not biting. Ah, uh, you already know. Going for some bass action. Alright, stay tuned and hopefully we can catch them. Alright, water's pretty muddy, so... I got the stuff first. Done pretty good on this color for bass, actually. When the water's a little stained, stands out a lot better than any other color. I highly recommend a backpack that's got some kind of strap like this. The best one that I found are like skateboarding backpacks that's got strap that goes all the way across. So you can carry multiple rods just like this. Alright. All the rain that we've been getting, it's all muddy now. So if you've never fished this area, of course this is in Spanish, which pretty much says no fishing. Can't fish from up here. So this is basically where everyone fishes at. So the best spot is right there in that current. But what happens is this current kind of goes out there and it whips back this way. And so you get this school of fish that gets stuck over here too. Danger, keep off. On this way. Oops. Been out here in a while. Yeah, this water is super stained. I don't think these trucks can even see my bait. I have to throw something real flashy. So this is basically my setup, floater, down the split shot, tiny, tiny hook, I don't know, maybe a size 10 or 12, and one wax worm. You got a bite? <laughs> <laughs> the old man got a trout. Oh, he jumped out there. Oh, I don't think I can cast that far. Sit 
Yeah, I'm stuck in the rock. Time to switch it up. All right, got the gold cast master on. Quarter ounce cast master. time left oh the water's super low here if we don't catch trout hopefully we can uh, catch a bass Ducks are dark. Look at the colors on those duck. duck are these any luck out there oh trout too huh nice are they on the bottom or suspended on the bottom okay This guy out. See if I can uh, get these bass to go on a lipless. Just letting it fall down to the grass, ripping it free. Hopefully, that'll trigger these bass. A lot of grass in this lake. Too much grass. <laughs> oh, just that hit. Oh man, something hit. <laughs> Completely missed it. Dang it. I got one, I got one. <laughs>
Two pounder? No, maybe a pound and a half. <laughs> Little guy. That's still bass. We didn't skunk today. Got one, yeah, no skunk today. <laughs> Bouncing it on the bottom? That one, I was slowly uh, rolling it back. Did you get a bite? What? You got a bite? I think I did. I got to it. I let it drop to the bottom. I just dropped my light. What happened? Huh? What happened? I don't know. I thought I was still thinking. When you set the hook, there was nothing? Yeah. I had two bite already. What? Caught one, I got a bite. And he, he caught a trout out here. He Look at that. Caught a rainbow trout. There you go. Right when I ripped it off the grass. Oh, it's a solid one. That's how they should be eating the lipless. Choking it. It's just the Strike King. Red eye shed. It's a nice one. There she goes. Well, that's it for today, guys. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in the next episode.